The following contest is a last man standing match. Making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the Superstar. All these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance. I can't wait to see what unfolds. Can this man face the music against the greatest kick in sports entertainment? I think there's a special rendition of Sweet Chin Music with his name on it. Now here comes one of the greatest of all time, the Heartbreak Kid. And his opponent from San Antonio, Texas, Weighing in at 227 pounds, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. Ladies and gentlemen, there is a reason that this man's nickname is Mr. WrestleMania. One of the greatest performers in the history of WWE. After missing nearly four years with a severe back injury, some doubted we would ever see Michaels in WWE again. Yeah, here's the thing, Corey. After returning, some say Shawn Michaels is better now than he's ever been. Certainly a hard point to argue. One of the greatest of all time, Mr. WrestleMania. every day of the week, we'd run out of superstars by the end of the year. That might be true, but what makes the last man standing match so difficult? One thing that's difficult is that all of your submission or pinfall moves in your arsenal go right out the window, so we can feel very limiting. That might feel limiting to some, but to other superstars, it's liberating. In a last man standing match, you don't have to worry about being disqualified or taking a fall. It's all about incapacitating your opponent. Tremendous pressure applied. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Big forearm. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Set up for the side Russian leg sweep. Most people wouldn't think it, but a last man standing match is one of the more cerebral matches there is. It's not just brute strength you'll need. You need to be aware of your environment and all the tools at your disposal. I agree, Corey. It's the smarter superstar who's going to get the upper hand in this one. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker. Some miscues from Shawn Michaels here. That'll turn your lights out. Strong right forearm. Able to interrupt the attack. Oh, man, right across the chest. One, two. Into the ring again. And that'll stop the count. This match continues on. Flying forearm smash from the Heartbreak Kid. Find the star. Now, come on. This is just too much. I agree. The ref had already started to count. Defiant counter from HBK. Drop kick. Great athleticism. Oh. 
Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Duplex! He's looking a little off balance. Gets him with the counter. Cinched in deep. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. Paul Nelson locked in pretty good here. Oh, look at the power. That's tremendous power. He gets the break. Snap suplex. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Now. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Oh man, the referee just counted to seven. This match isn't over yet. Guess he caught another win. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Getting back into the ring. Coming took advantage. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? The steel chair. Looks like he's opted to go with the simple but effective statement here. He gets back into the ring. Put in position now. Ooh, he'll turn the trachea. Taking a moment to let the crowd know how much he appreciates them. And this match will continue. Man, there is no quit. Defiant counter from HBK. Oh, Sean can't be stopped now. Momentum is the best friend of the heartbreak kid. So it's called. Here is your winner, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. And the celebration's underway. You could just sense the intensity in the air throughout this one. Yeah, this win was well earned.